Water dog. Water dog. Water dog. So I've been uh, kind of struggling uh, with a bit of analysis paralysis about how I'm going to get this whole video vlog thing started off. How to start off my more meaningful me. And uh, this morning, I just was looking through some of my notes and I came to realize, wait a second, wait a second. What you got to do is you just got to just jump right into it, Tim. You can't mess around. So this morning when I was looking through some of my notes that I'd been keeping over the last month, I came up with this uh, one quote that uh, was right at the very, very top of the list, of course. And it was from uh, Charles Eames. He's a furniture designer. He made this. So anyways, Charles Eames came up with this quote. He said, take your pleasure seriously. I mean, how could you argue with that? So taking pleasure seriously, that's what we're going to do today. And uh, that's going to include walking with my beautiful wife, taking our lovely Buddha dog macaroni for a little walk, enjoying the hot, hot summer day of Calgary, and we're also going to go see fireworks. Are you ready? Want to go for a walk? Yeah. yeah? You like to go for a walk? Always happy to go for a walk. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Now he's a happy boy. So many sniffs. Come on, Mackers. <laughs> so if we plan on going to the stampede around six, you want to go six? Sure. And then we can catch the chuck wagon races and the grandstand show. And eat a corn dog. And eat a corn dog. <laughs> I wonder how many Weight Watcher points are on a corn know. dog. Just so we know. No, Just so we know. Actually, it. I think the, the, the deal is that uh, on uh, during Calgary Stampede, the corn dogs have zero points. Really? Zero points. Well, mustard is definitely zero points. We'll just use extra mustard. <laughs> Good plan. <laughs> he sure likes to sniff. It's the best part. Best part about being a dog is the ability to sniff. Gross stuff. That's so. <laughs> what? What's that? <laughs> no. See, the, th the thing is about Macaroni is that he's 16 years old and he's uh, old and wise and he's been one of our best teachers. We often ask ourselves, if you were in a particular situation and it bothered you, what would Macaroni do? And he'd probably go, ah. I'd probably just piss on it. <laughs> Pee on it. <laughs> oh, I'm just so hot, Dad. Oh, I'm just so hot. I can't make my tongue hang out of my mouth any further. It's the longest tongue that I've ever had. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Now a little lunch, and we might as well take the convertible. Boom, that's how it's done. Okay, so that didn't work out as well as I had hoped. Uh, went to go and get into the uh, car and uh, took the convertible to lunch, but then had some mechanical problems and now I've just gotten back from, well, taking it into the repair shop. So the day is not going as planned, but I'll tell you what, 
there's still fireworks tonight, and that's a good thing. Oh, and there's one more thing that, I, that I'm going to do. I got this, uh, I got this whole great big box of uh, CDs that I'm going to send to uh, one of my listeners from Tonic. His name is Jerry, and uh, he's in his 80s. He used to phone me all the time and tell me how much fun he was having when he was listening to the show. So I'm going to make sure that he gets a big box of CDs because he listens to music about 16 hours a day from what I hear. So Jerry, you got a great big box of CDs coming to you. Hope you like them. I hope Jerry really likes that. My most loyal listener. Outdoor show or? Oh, we can pick it right here. So. Hello. Who wants us? This is even. Oh, baby. It's resting pretty on good. my ears. At it is. Put it more. Four. There you go. So these ones have a band inside. Hey there, girl. Is a little big. <laughs> hey, girl. Next, we'll feature some of the top guns from the Canadian Pro Association. Jamie Lamacain. Rogers communication, he's having a good spring, sits seventh overall. He uh, won the new. <laughs> so, right off the bat, the first thing that Michelle says is corn dog? Corn dog? Corn dog? We're going to have corn dog. <laughs> oh, howdy, by the way. How are you? On a Calgary Stampede. What's that? Regular. Happy girl. Happy, Happy girl. Corn dog. Do you have mustard? <laughs> <laughs> I don't have mustard. Ketchup. No mustard. Here we go. Fresh bottle. <laughs> See, the only reason why we want the mustard is because it has no calories. <laughs> <laughs> but there's no. Good reason. There's no calories in, uh, on the, in the corn dog, though, right? Extra mustard. Happy girl. Happy girl. They didn't. Uh, they didn't. Uh, this one is. Uh, this one is uh, definitely. It's been cut. <laughs> it's been cut. Okay, here we go. Oh yeah. Nice job. Huh? As they match strides and glide around that board, and Chris Tommy. Yeah! 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 Awesome. Ray Mitchwick right in there with Jamie Lambert in the middle of the pack. We got fireworks. It's always fireworks with you, honey. Oh, oh I know. That was good, wasn't it? So that's, uh, that show is produced by a friend of mine, Dave Pierce, and he's just, well, he's a brother of mine, actually. And uh, he always does such a great job, and I don't know how he keeps it all figured out and everything, but boy. So we had a good day. We had a nice, lovely walk with macaroni, and we also had a lovely uh, try to go out for lunch, but the car broke down. That's okay. But we got the fireworks, as promised, and we're at the Calgary Stampede, so I think that was a pretty good day. I think this was a more meaningful day, so hey, mission accomplished.